Yes, let's talk about NX1. I'm Johannes Rauschnabel, I'm a GMP expert at Syntagon, and I want to tackle some of the key aspects of NX1. The first aspect is now quality risk management and contamination control strategy is integrated into the document. So you can go from what your product needs, show by data what you do, and this helps a lot to get to the best quality uh, in the end of your manufacturing. Another aspect are appropriate technologies. Uh, it is recommended, or as the document is written, says it should be considered to use appropriate technologies for manufacturing of sterile products. And they row uh, some examples like barrier systems, wraps and isolator, robotics and also rapid micro technologies to get the operator out of the system, out of the manufacturing process and by that reduce the risk of contamination and thereby increase the quality of the product. Creating sterility and keeping sterility are big important parts of the document. Creating sterility means you have to keep to the listed uh, processes like uh, dry heat, uh, autoclaving, ethylene oxide or gamma irradiation. Keeping sterility means you have to do the setup of parts which are already rendered sterile with closed doors and through glove ports. The last aspect is first air. First air means that there should be no interruption of unidirectional airflow between the entry plane and the openly exposed product. So it means the open container. And that means that anything from the equipment which is in between has either to be removed, that's the highest priority, or if it can't be removed like filling needles, uh, then you have to make them uh, exchangeable and they should be autoclavable. By the way, open isolators should be mentioned uh, in this context. Open isolators have a mouse hole in the front to get empty containers in and in the end to get the, enters, uh, the containers filled and finished out of the system. Those isolators have now to be placed in a grade C environment while it was a grade D before. That means a lot more effort to get products, components, empty containers to the line and the filled and finished product out to the inspection and warehousing. Thank you. More details will be followed up here on LinkedIn.